Right, what's up, I'm Ayan, and in this video, I am going to show you how you can keep your Discord up to date on Linux by using a simple script. This script is actually created by my friend, and he also told me how this works. So, I'm gonna just gonna make a video on it. First of all, you have to do, go to this link, I will provide this link in the description so you can check it out for yourself. And on Linux, Discord does not update automatically. I don't know why. All you have to do is open up Discord and it starts updating. But this thing is not going is going to change for now. This is a script that whenever your system boots up, it automatically checks for updates on Discord and downloads everything. So whenever you open up Discord, you are ready to do. First of all, all you have to do is open up your terminal and give it some root access by typing sudo su. Now you have root access on your terminal, which means you are good to go. Now we have to copy the first command right here, which is the create the script file, paste the command right here, hit enter and this will open up the script created something. Now all you have to do is go to this stage, uh, this file, this is the script file. You can actually directly download it, but I recommend that you copy this raw file and create your own script. Uh, open up the terminal again after you have copied the raw file and paste it right here. Once this is done, if you check, it is good. Now, Control plus X to save the file. I'm just gonna Control plus X and hit Y to yes and hit enter. And now you have created the script file in the desired dictionary. Now, let's make the script executable. So, for this, we are going to Copy the second line of commands, open up your terminal again, like this, paste it right here, hit enter, and now we have the script executable. To be on the safe side, I recommend that you copy these things as well. So it's gonna copy the first line and add the, just like this, add this fourth line at the end of the line i actually already made this file just to test it and it was working correctly so i'm just gonna first say should i redo it again or just keep the video as it is now i'm just gonna redo it again let me just you won't have that last line so you have to manually add this line just copy the fourth line and paste it right here like this now Control plus X to save the file, press Y to confirm and hit enter to save it. So these are some notes that you need, you might need. So it is highly recommend that you run these as well. Also make sure you have these some, these certain packages installed like curl, dpack and things like that. So I'm just gonna make the first one. If it gives you any error on this stage, search for inter, uh, type in curl debug and those little bit of commands it will automatically install those prerequisites and you will be good to go so if you don't get the any errors so all you have to do is just copy this last command and paste it at the end of the line so all you have to do is now Replace your username with your actual username, which you can find right here on the terminal as well. It says root at ion. It is all caps ion. So I am going to change the username. There we go. You can see the username is ion on my. Now the command is ready. All you have to do is control plus X to save the file confirm by pressing Y and hit enter to save it it looks like our work here is now done now this is a simple file now every time you boot your laptop or your system this script will run in the background and check for updates of discord and download all the updates if Discord is somehow deleted or missing, it will actually automatically download Discord for you as well. Yep, I am just making sure that all of these things are installed. You see, curl is installed and it is showing as it is. 
if curl was not installed it will automatically give you the option to install you have to do press y and hit enter it will install all these curl and some dependencies that this script requires to run anyway it looks like all of my dependencies are installed and i am checking them one by one if you get any error during this process you can check these dependencies at any point in the terminal you can even check the last one as well this is a list of all the dependencies that are already installed on your linux operating system okay nothing to check here anymore i guess let's check this script if it is working or not how do you check it by using the first command i'm just gonna close this open up the terminal again and type in sudo su because this script requires sudo access also known as root access let me type in the first i'm sorry about that i did okay how this script works yep this is the script you can find it by using the first commands that you have entered pressing the up arrow key brings, brings up all the recent commands which i am doing right now all right okay i'm i'm just getting confused at this point okay all you have to do is just sudo and enter the script pass as now you can see it is now connecting to the internet and is now downloading discord for me it found that discord was not installed and it is now installing discord for me automatically which is a good thing it will automatically update it as well so all you have to do is wait for it you don't have to be annoyed every time you open discord and wait for the updater to do its job it will automatically run in the background and whenever you open discord it will be ready to use without any further wait now let's wait for the script to download man my internet is very slow i actually need to upgrade my internet one day i hope while we are waiting for the discord to download i highly recommend that you press the subscribe button and get turn the notification on so you can get all the cool videos that i am uploading on my youtube channel okay looks like discord is now installed let's open it up see if any updates are available nope i don't think so discord is now starting and i it actually logged in because i was logged in on my browser very nice looks like you don't need to wait for updates anymore on linux Thanks my friend anyway that's been it thanks for watching i hope you like this video i will catch you guys in the next one take care bye bye and also it feels sad that my discord is empty <laughs> well no worries it will be good soon see ya let's open up discord again yep no requires of updates it automatically opens up very fast Nice 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 Man I'm going to keep this script on my personal Linux operating system This is the link that you can go to and this is my buddy who made this script See ya